Let me take my. Hey, Jesus! Take a chill pill. <laughs> <laughs> All right, for my next sketch, I'm gonna do a very overdone Shakespearean monologue <laughs> called "To Be or Not to Be" from Shakespeare's Hamlet. <laughs> All right, to be or not to be. Then, question. Ne not really like a question. I mean, there's no question mark or anything, but <laughs> you get the idea. Option A. Well, it is nobler than mine. The stuff of the slings and arrows of outrageous fortune. Ouch. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like that. Option B. Well, to take up arms in sincere troubles. Stop me there. That doesn't really make sense if you think about it. It's kind of mixed metaphor. Think about it. Can't really take up arms against the sea. Maybe think up a boat. <laughs> maybe maybe a sponge or something. <laughs> Anyways. To sleep, to die, and by a sleep to say we end the heartache and a thousand natural shocks that flesh is there to that's a consummation devoutly to be wished. It's so gloomy. <laughs> <laughs> really, I'm thinking maybe Hamlet should go up against the sea of Prozac or something. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, moving on. <laughs> to, to sleep, to die, wait. It's very repetitive here. I'm gonna skip ahead. <laughs> For who <laughs> oh would bear the whips and scorns of time again with the violence? I, just, I don't like it. Speaking of time, I'm kind of running low on time. It's a very long speech. So I'm going to just kind of take the next half and abridge it. <laughs> so good. If I had the balls to kill myself, then I would. But I don't, so I won't. And the nice thing is about my ending, it even rhymes. I don't, I won't. Just an idea. I'm not Shakespeare. What do I know? And scene. <laughs> <laughs> take your bow. Yeah. <laughs>